All right. It's week four. There wasn't a lot of um, news, so we're probably just going to you know, get into that first. <laughs> but um, there's like literally like one thing. Uh, there was a one hot fix on the 23rd, which is Friday of last week. Live now. Fixed issues. Wait. Players matched into non-preferred regions, which still happens sometimes. But, you know, it's going to it's going to flex you out a little bit. I think the their their restraint is under 100 ping, which I would like to see it a little bit lower because I don't want to go play ranked EU matches and have like 60 ping to 100 ping fireballs. It's just not very fun to me. But I think it's under 100, so if you're under that, then it is intended to working still. Fixed issue with BR matches having all bots, which I know a lot of people have been wanting that to be fixed for a while. So there we go on that one. Fixed issue with infinite matchmaking queue. I didn't actually know that was a thing, but it would explain all of the hour to two hour to three hour queue timers that we've been seeing on Reddit and everything. Increased ranked Dominion match search time. In some cases, more 5v5 matches with players on your platform, um, which I did actually see. I have noticed uh, today, I did notice that a lot. So uh, that was good. Also, uh, the very first legend is there, Kyrie. Um, if you don't know who Kyrie is, she's amazing and she's legend now. So she's the very first legend, uh, which is dope. Congratulations on that one. Uh, that's really it for the new stuff. Uh, then you got the quests. So the quests this week follow the same pattern um, as they do, as they have. There's a, It's more of a story driven line. This one is you're kind of proving to Blackthorn that you are able to go against the Val Breakers to kind of sway the Val Keepers to trust you more in type of a way. Uh, so there's three. Starts with Epic Ambush. Open one epic chest in Dustpool. The Valguard have been monitoring Dustpool quite a bit lately. Why don't you head there and cause a little chaos? Just open up one epic chest and leave the rest to me. Uh, when you do that, uh, these can be bugs. So when you go there and you open this epic chest, it might not happen. It didn't happen for me the first time. So the second time I went there, I opened the epic chest and um, some little Valguard uh, or Val Breaker Val Guards popped out and and you just kill them like you do at the uh, at the old towers, the elemental towers, which by the way, they change. We can get in that in a second. So then it goes to the second one, which is lurking vaults. Activate three mana vaults. You need to hold your own against a few ambushes. I have out. I have breakers watching the mana vaults throughout the Hollowlands. Activate one to trigger the ambush. Which just like the first one, it was bugged for me the very first game that I tried it. Uh, so then the second game, we opened the mana vaults, and then each mana vault triggered three Valguards as well. You just kill those and and you and or you exile them. Sorry, not kill, exile, and you go about it. Uh, one thing to note about this is you don't necessarily have to activate the mana vaults or the epic chest. You just have to deal with the Valguard. From what I've noticed, if I'm wrong and you don't run into that, I could go into another game and activate a mana vault. But from my end, I didn't have to activate this. Also, it does proc for your teammates when you do one of these for all three of these, it is, by the way. So the last one is sorted stockpiles. Destroy five magic stockpiles in Shadow Grace and Westmar. Um, and it actually connects from top to bottom where they are all the way around from Shadow Grace all the way down to Westmar. So destroy five magic stockpiles in Shadow Grace and Westmar. Now for the final act. The order has been nice enough to stockpile some magical artifacts for you. Destroy them. Show yourself to be an enemy of the order. Uh, these little tiny boxes, they're really small. Uh, and they're on the ground or on top of some other bigger, larger boxes, or maybe on top of platforms. Um, sometimes they're in like a house in the corner. They're 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 really small and they go and they glow. Um, just like the first two, it did not work the first time I saw it. I did see them; they were glowing. However, I would shoot at them and it just wouldn't it wouldn't proc or it wouldn't blow up. Uh, when you do, you'll know it'll vanish. One, it won't be there again. And there'll be a little lightning strike that that kind of happens after you've destroyed it um, for that. You also get the HoloLens Hero, a rare card, which is a, an Avira card. I think it's the first. Let me make sure. I think it's the very first Avira card uh, that we may have. We had a Thaddeus card and a Ferret card before we had a had an Avira card. Um, but yeah, so uh, those are the quests. Uh, you can do the honor quests. You have there, there does come with three new honor quests each week, and but you do have sixty-two days and twenty-two hours to finish those. So just go through all of those uh, and 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 finish them on your own leisure. But the story quests do roll over. Uh, do do not roll over. Uh, once the week is over, it's over. Uh, and there you go, guys. That's the week. Uh, if I miss anything, let me know down below. Uh, I love doing these videos, so if you love them too, let me know down below as well. Uh, if not, I'll see you uh, in stream, and you can tell me how much you hate them. See you guys. Peace. No ma'am, I go 